This is a portable easel that I made today. So I bought this um, wood and glued them together. And also this torque hinges. And I bought this magnets. We have some extra ones over here. And I use this Forstner drill, 25 millimeter, as big as this magnet. To put a hole, and then I put in some glue there. And this one right here, so that if I want to put some of the brushes, I could do so. And at the back, starts to crack and so this is my portable easel I'll show you later how it works and the way it goes is that you open it like that then you put the paint below over here and then the canvas over there and when you're done Kind of thinking if I should uh, put a varnish in it or just the natural um, oil for wood to make it more waterproof. I think I'll do the second one. Then I need this. The torque hinges and the magnets are working perfectly and I can even add a magnetic clip there if I want to put the brush and this is a very thick A4 um, canvas sketchbook so I can even change this to a lighter one and it will still work and there you go if I will buy this, um, the, the average price will be with the shipping is about 5,000 to 7,000 baht. And the cheapest one that I've seen, including shipping fee, is about 3,000. And this one that I made by myself, I actually have um, bought everything the magnets, the wood. And some of it I already have like this leather and the glue um, 
it's just less than 500 Thai baht. So I'm very happy with my DIY easel. And let me just show you this one. If I remove this, okay. there just in case I want to stick something else like um, I don't know um, reference or pencil or sponge anything and it's also very light okay I am planning to um, I've already put about two layers of the um, wooden polish but I think I'm also going to varnish it just to make sure that it will last long just in case I spill my water and therefore I need to be extra waterproof and like this just testing it out it's nicely and even if I use let's say bigger ones like let's get my Daniel Smith here the magnet is very strong project also another thing is that it's easy to keep so once you're done you just remove everything fold it like so and then pull the leather hook it up in the D, D ring there hold tight and then it and then you can remove it from the quick release the back and there you go Also, the best part is that I can literally take it anywhere because it can fit any 14 to 15 inch backpack um, where you put your laptop. So there. Fits snugly and just flip it and then you don't have to worry about it. 